Yes! Come on! Come on! Oh, we're gonna go over it! Yes! What's the level above me, Minji Masters? Oh, God. Hey, guys! How's it going? My name is Neil, and welcome back to some more beam and g drive now before this video begins i gotta apologize i have not uploaded in like two or three days and for that i apologize but i actually moved my office from the downstairs up to the upstairs because i wanted to get some more sunlight uh i was down i spent like 12 hours a day doing youtube and it gets kind of uh depressing sitting in a dark room all day so i moved it upstairs but don't worry that uh, office that I built is not going to waste. I turned it into a movie theater, which is pretty awesome. But anyway, the second reason I haven't uploaded is because I, if you can't tell, my voice is a little bit different. I actually have like a cold right now, so I didn't want... I, 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 yesterday, I could not record at all because my voice just sounded like trash, but it sounds good enough today to record. So that's what we're going to do. Anyway, we're back with some more BMNG Drive, and in today's video, we're going to be checking out yet another test map. This one's called the BN. MG testering or the beam MG testering. I really like the thumbnail the art right there. That looks awesome You want to make my thumbnails dude? That'd be amazing. Anyway, yeah, this is another test arena But it was getting some pretty good reviews. So I wanted to go ahead and check it out. So let's do it Alrighty, so here we are now. I have not checked this out before recording. I just went straight into it So we have a D series right here. I love the D series but I want something a little bit faster. We need something that could do mad stunts because this is a testing arena. So it's, I'm pretty sure it's going to have a lot of jumps and uh, opportunities to crash, if you know what I mean. So um, I usually go for the sunburst. So let's go for like a, a quick but nimble one. So maybe like the, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Pre-runner maybe? I, I never use this thing, but it's so cool. It's like an off-road freaking uh, sunburst. So let's go ahead and try this one out. Alrighty, so here we go. Now, this is pretty much just the starting. Is there anything back here? It's like an abandoned building. Is there anything in here that I should know about, though? I don't see anything. So, yeah, I guess this is just the starting area, but I did see a big old sign over here. Now, what does it say? Does it say anything useful to me? Acceleration and big crash. Well, those sound like two pretty awesome things, so let's go ahead and gun it. I, I imagine this is probably going to lead to my death but you know what that's okay with me that's what all I'm just all about crashes and oh there's a Jim Connor section okay that's cool oh god oh okay uh did not mean to do that whoops okay let's go ahead and try that again and maybe this time let's try not crashing but it seemed like this road was very slippery now I'm not quite sure if it was my car doing that or if it's the actual road but I'm just gonna assume that was just me being a terrible driver. Look at me now. I'm not sliding all over the dang place. How long does this road go on for? Where is the crash and death and fiery explosions? I was promised. Okay, so it's just a lot of a lot of road here. Not much to see. Is there oh I see something. Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh, it's a wall! It's a wall! Oh. No! No! I accidentally reset my car. Oh my god, are you kidding me? You know what? We're gonna restart the map because I need a better car than this. <laughs> it's not fast enough and it like barely smashed because this thing is like reinforced. So let's go ahead and reload this map because I wanna try that again. All right, so you know what? I'm gonna go with a different car here. So maybe like a, I don't know, maybe like a really fast ETK. Yes, that sounds awesome. So let's go with the 800 series. This thing was beating out uh, the other ETK series in a drag race. So this thing, is a uh, serious business ladies and gentlemen this is probably one of the fastest wagons in the entire world so let's go ahead and do that do that basically head-on collision again probably getting close to 200 miles an hour so this is gonna be pretty pretty crazy oh god this is this this car is just gonna fold in on itself and that is what I like to see all right here we go 160 and oh <laughs> we have flattened the front of this car. Where's the engine? Is it? Oh, yeah, it's, it's in the back seat. Holy crap. We knocked the engine all the way into the back seat of this car. That is absolutely crazy. Well, you know, the back, I mean, from the back, it doesn't really look like it got in that big of a collision. But once you kind of spin it around like this. It is just complete mayhem. Man, we really did a number on this thing. All right, so 
That is the big big acceleration pr plus the crash, but what happens if we actually take... I know it said Jim Gymkhana over here, so I kind of want to see what's actually over here. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Nice. Nice. Did we break... Oh, yeah, we broke something. Dang it! Sometimes it's a little bit too easy to break your car. All I did was kind of slide, and I broke the freaking car. So, yeah, this is not... Probably not the best Jim Connor car, but we're gonna pretend it is. So what what do we have? Like a giant warehouse? Okay, okay. Great. That's just great. Yeah, you know Jim Connor is more about uh precision and uh style rather than speed. So I don't know why I was going that fast, but oh yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. We can like kind of uh wiggle our way through here. So yeah, it's a pretty basic uh Jim Connor setup, but that doesn't make it any less cool. Alright, so Let's try to do like a sick drift here. Here we go, and wait, where does this lead? Oh, it leads into the okay. So this is definitely not the right car, but it can get the it can get the job done in a pinch if you just want some Jim Connor kind of action. And you don't have an actual car set up for Jim Connor, kind of, because really who does? Except for Ken Block. I'm pretty sure he's probably one of the only people on the damn planet who has a car. Perfect for Jim Connor. When's the next uh, Jim Connor coming out anyway? I I like watch those religiously, and I haven't seen any news. Maybe I'm just not looking in the right places. But anyway, let's go ahead and follow the road here and see if there's anywhere else that we can get some sweet sweet action, and maybe just maybe some destruction. You know, this map looks like it go. Oh, there's stuff over there. So yeah, there definitely is stuff. But where is the uh, roads to turn in to go to that? Is there even any roads that connect all this stuff together? I'm not really sure. We seem to have, what is that, I guess, a uh, corn silo or something? I'm not really sure. They never really specify that in the Beam and G lore. There's a road. We're going to crash into the pole again. <laughs> oh, man. All right. So let's just take this way and see where. That is a big cruise ship just for no reason on the coast. Wait, is that on, is that on ground right now? Hold the phone. I want to see what's going on with this cruise. Can I drive on that thing? Can somebody make like, oh no, it's just off the coast. Dang it! We just wrecked our car for no reason. I kind of want to get a closer look at this thing though. I've never really seen these up close, but oh yes, those textures though are just, <laughs> they're awful, but you know, they're not really meant to be seen from up close, so you know, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, where's our car? Oh yeah, right, right there. Okay, so let's go ahead, respawn that there, go back to which we were, and uh, see what else this map has to offer us. All right, drift it. Oh, there's a ditch. <laughs> I should have seen that coming. Anyway, all right, so what do we got here? We have another big old sign. What does that say? Racetrack under construction. So it's not done yet. Here, I guess we can go ahead and check it out anyway. Although that is my job. I have to check out everything. I see a giant woman in the background. Is that what I'm seeing on that sign over there? I'm pretty sure that was in one of the thumbnails as well. People were talking about it. But yeah, this is one heck of a racetrack. If I ever did say so myself. Now, what is this over here? What is this? Yeah, that is a woman. It's a clickbait. Oh, yeah, I can use that as clickbait. Anyway, what is this? Is this the racetrack, quote, unquote? Oh, I think he's putting in a... Wait, what the heck? Is that like a goal? Are you making Rocket League and Beam and G Drive? I've waited for somebody to make that forever, but nobody actually has. If somebody wants to make a Rocket League mod, definitely do so I will I will I would love you eternally forever you know what I mean all right so the uh, racetrack definitely is uh, under construction now what is this I see a bunch of jumps here oh what is this okay so let's go back to that road that we were on so that is the racetrack oh wait destruction derby oh 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 okay so that's the racetrack and here is where you do destruction derbies okay so he has this like sectioned off for different events, although we can't really do destruction derbies right now. There's not much. To, I, I might have to get Gray in on this so we can uh, explore this map together because it seems like it is heavily influenced by a uh, multiplayer. So yeah, I might have to talk to him about that. But for now, let's go ahead. Oh man, I love the art on this dude. You're really good at making signs in this game. Anyway, let's go ahead and follow the good old uh, road and see what else. I'm just. I'm glad they're all separated with signs so you know exactly what you're getting yourself into. Now, what is this? A gas station and uh, landing gear skill? What does that mean? I see a bunch of jumps though, so I guess we're just doing a bunch of jumps. Oh, too far, we're fine. Just the front bumper, don't worry about it. 
And let's do another one. Beautiful. That front bumper's hanging on by a friggin' thread right now. Okay. Okay, okay. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Hot, fast, and insane. Dude. How are you making these? This is awesome. I love this. All right, so let's keep going. You know, some might say that's a little bit tacky, but I, I oh god, oh god, oh god. Who, whoever thought it was a good idea to let me behind the wheel? Man, I've crashed like 15 times for no reason. We're just gotta, sl it's a slalom section. Just gotta slalom it, baby. Gotta slalom it. All right, some more jumps. All right, so ooh, oh, it's like a car parkour. Oh, I love these. Oh, how I love these. Alright, just go. Ooh, yes. Beautiful. No damage to the car yet. Oh, God. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Yeah. There we go. Perfectly. Perfect landing. Alright, here we go. Where does this lead to? What's the end game here? Oh, okay. We probably should have got a car with a little bit better specs here. Oh, we got a rally section. Oh, that's awesome. I love it. Ugh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Just a little bit of a rear end damage, but that's fine. He even has, like, his logo on all of the crates and stuff laying around. That's awesome, dude. Oh, is that a jump I see? Yes, this car was def- Oh, it's not a jump. Dang it, this car is definitely not made for rally racing. Oh, God. There goes our front tire. Don't worry about it. Just pretend like it didn't happen. Did we really just get stuck on this? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Okay, let's just- Continue. Pretend that didn't happen, guys. All right, so we got a nice little rally section through a tropical island. You don't see those very, very often. Excuse me. Is this another jump? Oh, that's a jump. Oh, that's a big jump. Holy crap. Yes! We landed it perfectly. Oh, wait. My car feels slower. Did I break something? Oh, no. I, th I think I'm good. The car just feels very slow. Maybe it's because we're off-road, but it definitely feels different. I thought I nailed that landing, though. It felt really good. Now, where the heck am I now? Oh, did it just lead back to where I was, I guess? Okay. Okay. Oh, monster jump. Okay, now this is what I've been waiting for. Oh, this is going to be beautiful. Is this the one with the giant woman on it? Uh, YouTube. Oh, oh yeah, there's a free plug. Beeman G Masters. Go ahead and check him out. I'm sure he's... I'm sure he's great. Anyway, oh, this is a, oh god, oh, this is a big jump. Wait, what's going on? Oh god, oh, oh, okay, okay, careful, careful. Oh, that is a big jump. Oh god, what is this leading? Am I gonna land on that woman? I think so. Oh, buddy, here we go. Yes, we're gonna land on her. I don't know, mommy's boy. No, no, badass. Yeah, there we go. I kind of want to get a headshot on her, though. All right, so we're obviously going to need something uh, a little bit faster here. Whoa, God, where am I? So we're going to need to go all the way back. And we need some sort of a rally car, I think, don't you think? So, yeah, let's go all the way back. I think this is enough enough room to, uh, to get enough speed. And did I say rally car? I meant drag car. We need some sort of drag car to make it to the top. So we're going to go with the good old Moonhog drag. A classic. Can't go wrong there. So this, uh, this should get us. Maybe we'll land over the jump. That would be awesome. Anyway, if we can make it there in one piece, I think this is our best bet of making it. Uh! <sighs> I forgot how hard this thing is to control. Okay, slowly. There we go. And then got it. There we go. Okay, this is the best way. Now, we got to remember there's a bridge here. The bridge. Yes, the road is out. So here we go. So far, so good. Keep it steady. Almost 200 miles an hour. Yes. Yes. Come on. Come on. Oh, we're going to go over it. Yes. What's the level above me, Minji Masters? Oh, God. <laughs> Straight into the water. All right. So maybe we should tone it down just a tad. Maybe that was a little bit too fast for us there. So maybe like an SBR4. Maybe like the uh, twin turbo edition. This is a pretty fast car. Not as fast as, you know, a drag car, but I think we should be able to get that, uh, that headshot. Man, why we, why is there a giant woman on this ramp, though? That's kind of, a uh, it's kind of strange. But I'm, I'm not gonna question it. The dude loves women. He loves his women, and he loves his BMG. I mean, I can't, I can't, uh, I can't, I can't judge him from that. Anyway, here we go. 150. Yes! 
Really? Really? <sighs> we landed right on the uh, <laughs> lower down under bits. Oh man, I thought that one was going to go really far. It's just that ramp slows you down so much. So we need something a little bit faster. But what do we have that is faster than the SBR4? Maybe, maybe the, uh, the Thunderball edition? That one's pretty quick. I think it actually is faster than the twin turbo. Uh-oh. And we lost a tire, so that's not going to work. I should have known that. I knew there was one car where the tires just fall off. But of course... It has to be the one I want to use. All right, so maybe the hill climb edition will be fast enough. I mean, oh wait, maybe the monster. I don't know. Maybe, eh. I feel like, I feel like the hill climb edition is probably the quickest one we have available to us at the moment. But this one's not going to want to, oh, okay. This one's not going to want to fly because of those giant wings. So I'm kind of scared to see what's going to actually happen here. But we're going to try it anyway. Oh God, oh God, we're, oh no, we're off track. No! into another tree. How many times have I hit a tree slash a light pole in today's video? We should probably put a tally marker or something. Anyway, can we, uh, can we try not crashing before we actually get to the jump? That would be great. Oh, God. Yeah, it's that, it's that little jump right after the, uh, right after that, uh, that, uh, bridge right there that's screwing me up big time. So, come on. Just keep it steady, man. Keep it steady. Keep it steady. Keep it steady. Oh, my God! We did it! Okay, we did it! Okay, just keep it steady. Keep it steady, keep it steady, keep it steady, keep it steady, keep it steady! Yeah! It's pushing us down! We're gonna land on Mama's balls. <laughs> Dang it! <sighs> so maybe, you know what, maybe we should just use the drag car again and maybe slow up just a tad before we hit the ramp and then maybe we can get that, uh, that headshot! Alright, take two with the Moonhawk drag. Um, so yeah, let's slow down just a tad here. So maybe like this. Looking good. Looking good! Looking very good! Yes! Beautiful! Right on her cheek! <laughs> That's something you don't see every day. A drag car flying through the air and landing on the picture of a giant woman. That's beautiful. I love it! Alright, so is there anything else I missed? I don't believe so there's a road that leads back to that ramp but i believe that's pretty much it for this map at least for now uh if he does upload if he does update this map i'll make sure to take a look at it but for now i think that's gonna go ahead and do it i'll leave the link to this map in the description below if you go if you guys want to check it out but yeah for now make sure to like comment and subscribe and i'll talk to you guys in the next video i'm gonna try to upload two videos a day from now on, guys. Uh, don't hold me to it, but I'm going to try my best. Anyway, I'll see you. Bye-bye.